Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Sir Gabs again. Um, this part of the video, we are talking about the limit of a function examples. And we have a specific example here, uh, a piecewise function. So this is the graph of the piecewise function. Um, I hope na kagi mo ni Gen Math and also in the previous years in your junior high school. Um, no, na halo din no? halo ni siya portion dere because this is the graph of the first function 2x minus 1 and notice that the condition is greater than 0 so but pasal but why labot ang 0 if you substitute 0 here may mo siyang 2 times 0 which is 0 minus 1 is negative 1 so we have here 0 and negative 1 pero remember wala labot ang 0 so that's why nakahalo na siya and the way is it's already shaded or um, dili na na siya halo because less than or equal naman siya. So, appeal lang 0. When we say less than or equal, appeal lang 0. Kani, greater than 0, meaning mas dako sa 0. In other words, why lambot ang 0. That's why nakahalo ang graph nila. But for this one, appeal na siya because less than or equal naman siya. Yeah. Na piecewise, meaning putol-putol siya, no? Naka piecewise. Unya, evaluating the limit, we are to evaluate, I mean, we are to find the limit of the function, the piecewise function, as x approaches 0. So, same method that we will do, we will still do the table. Okay? So, do hagi hapon ka book, no? We will evaluate the limit from the left and the limit from the right. So, if we start, no, from the left, again, 0 at ang itan So, kanini add rin number 3, the value of x. So, ang bata na to, ano, no? The same story. We will try to squeeze the value 0 in the x axis. Okay? Actually, one delete kami gin importante kay ang illustration. I'm just showing these illustrations here for the sake of discussion. But during the quiz or during the test, there's no need for it to graph unless it's being stated for it to graph. But in our case, no, here sa ito, uh, wala na. Pero kung require na. Importante yan eh, sa kasabot mo, um, I'm just showing the illustration para maka-gets mo what's happening. No? Yeah, from here, if you will do the table, uh, same story, ganina. In the previous videos, rather, so you have x and f of x. And then, um, the values, as for the values, magdepende depend niya kung sa yung limited ng values. So, if it's approaching 0, probably it would be best to start with negative 2 or pwede sa negative 1. Um, probably, I just start with negative 2, siguro. Negative 2, negative 1, um, negative 0 0.5, negative 0. Point, um, approaching, almost 0, no? so 0, 0, 1, negative 0. Point, um, five decimal places. Okay. So notice the number here. No, notice it's approaching zero. Oh, always remember that. Na, kung asa ka pa doon mo, nasa na yung buhang kibali buhaton. So approaching zero na siya. Yeah, kani siya, again, if you will recall, mao ni siya, we are trying to evaluate the limit of the function, the limit, di na lang ako iso kata kayo, medyo taas, f of x na may butang. The limit of the function as x approaches um, 0 from the left. Okay? So, sa left uh, we have uh, next start. Yeah, for the other table, for the second table, we will try to approach gihapon 0, but this time from the right. So, this is x and this is f of x. And um, 5 values gihapon na table 0. Yeah. Probably you can just copy the numbers, ano, but this time positive nata. Okay, from the right, madam, start. So we start the old positive 2, 1, and then um, 0 0.5 in the positive, 0 0.001, and uh, positive 0 0.5 na sa decimal places. Okay, so in the same story, we are also gihapon. Approaching now, we are still approaching zero, but this time from from the right. So, pariho na yapon the limit. Di lang yapon kung piecewise kita as kayo sa kano mga piece sa space. As x approaches zero, positive. Okay. Anyway, there's no need for you to ano to indicate these things here. Kaya nito ba? Uh, probably it's best na may table uh, just to check or just to make sure na everything is right. So, kani siya, sorry, unnecessary na siya. I'm just writing all these things for the sake of my discussion. Okay? So, more likely, ang inyong solution shorter na ginasa ko mga solutions because I am writing everything as much as I can 
for the ano for the sake of discussion para mas makasabot mo. Unya, next to that, no same story, you will just substitute, okay? Ano lang ha, very crucial is ang um, pag-identify which one. Kasi okay? horrible ng functions sa tangitan na oh. Uh, both functions are linear. So, when I say linear functions, the graph is lines. It's a line. Mo na bitaw ng puros na lines diha. Nag-separate lang sila. Mo na piecewise na diha. Unya, um, kani, restricted na siya, restricted na siya for numbers greater than zero. Kani siya, mo na gamiton for numbers less than or equal to zero. So, you have to observe, no? Kani, tanaw na to, negative 2, negative 1, negative 0.5, these negative numbers, are these numbers greater than or less than zero? So, syempre, makita na ito, uh, this belongs to less than or equal to zero. So, doon na siya nag-belong. Uh, what color do you use? Kanya lang. So, kanil siya nga numbers, kanil. Kanil numbers itong isa tap, kanil. Dili na siya masood na condition. Okay? So, make sure na you will use 1 minus 4x, not this one. Okay? Basta yung malipatan, ano, kay piswai sa ba, kanil. Uh, you have to understand nga uh, these numbers are within this condition. Okay? So, kani nga, function yung mga gamitan. Unya, for these numbers, kani siya, what color? Uh, um, red? Sige. So, kani nga numbers, 2, 1, 0 0.5, all these numbers are positive. Dari na siya nasood na condition. So, we will use this function for these numbers here. Okay, so then I'm say pang substitute. Okay, klaro kong tala ha, kaya kasi malipat na. Unya, so let's do it. Negative 2, substitute here, what will happen? So, neg uh, negative 4 times negative 2 is positive 8, so you have 9. Um, kaya mo lang yun ako, or put. So you have 9 here as our volume. Okay, if you want to make sure guys, you can use your calculator at any time. Para mas klaro sa dibuha ang answer. If you substitute negative 1, so negative 4 times negative 1 is positive 4. You have plus 1, you have 5, positive 5. Negative 4 times negative 0 0.5 is positive 2. Plus 1, you have positive 3. Mayroon na pita guys kayo. Mag-calculator na tayo para dito malipat. So, substitute lang nyo siya, di ha sa x. So, this would be 1 minus 4 times uh, the negative 0 0.001. So, that should be 1.004. 1.004. Okay? Substitute this one, ya po di ha. So, pinanan na. Uh, na five decimal places. So, 1 minus 4 times negative 0 point oh, pat ka 0 and then 1. So, that should be 1.0004. 1.00. Pila ka 0 na? Yung oh, pat ka 0 sa siya and then 4. Okay? So, if you will try to observe 9, 5, 3, 1.0004, 1.0004, so, meaning, kung magkalaghan ng 0, magkalaghan sa ng 0 per 94 sa last part. In other words, the number is actually getting closer and closer to 1. Okay? So, in this case, we say that the limit of the function as x approaches 0 from the left is equal to positive 1. Okay? In this second scenario, dito ang lapita, substitute niya ako, no? But this time, atong gamiton is kanini ang function na. Dito rin ang substitute. Because again, these numbers here of x belongs to this condition. Okay? Greater than 0. Substitute, so may mo siyang 2 times 2 is 4, minus 1, you have 3. Yeah, 2 times 1, substitute ng 1 niya, is 2, minus 1 is 1. Then 0 0.5, so 2 times 0 0.5 is 1, minus 1, that should be 0. Kanina rin apart, calculator na para sure. So that should be 2 times um, 0 0.001 minus 1 is equal to 0 0.998. Negative, sorry. Negative 0 
Yeah, it's 998. Merkada nasan siya? 2 times 0. Point, upat ka 0. And then 1 minus 1. So this should be negative 0. Point, upat ka 9. And then 8. Okay? So, if you pick point laro nimo, pwede ka mo puno another value. Okay? It's up to you. Pwede ka mo puno 0 point nga, 10 ka 0, and then 1. It's up to you. So, kani, magkita naman ang pattern actually. So, 3, 1. No? From the positive side, 3, 1, and then 0. And then, negative 0 point 9 and 8. Then, pagkahuman ka niya, negative 0 point 9, 9, 9, 9, 8. So, basically, magkita na ito. Nga, it's actually approaching negative 1. Okay? So, from here, we say that the limit of the function as x approaches 0 from the right is equal to negative 1. Okay? Kunya, kanya siya, kanya siya, tanawa ni mo, kung from the left ka, positive 1 ang limit. Kung from the right ka, negative 1 ang limit. So, in this case, the limit of the function niya, ha? so in general, in inclusion, the limit of um, 2x minus 1 for all x greater than 0 and 1 minus 4x for all x less than or equal to 0 as x approaches 0 ang ito ang answer ni guys ha is the n e so buot pa siyang buot the limit does not exist. The limit does not exist when the limit from the left and the limit from the right are not equal. So, timan on the naha. Walay limit nga mo exist kung ang limit sa right and left dili equal. So, this is different from the previous example about the one sided limit. Kay sa one sided limit, ang usa ka limit mong lato wala siya na exist. It's impossible for us to get the limit. And then there exists a limit on the other side. Now, if you recall the one-sided, ang usa wa ni exist, ang usa ni exist. So, mo tong yung tag one-sided limit. But for this one, the two sides, no, ang limits sa two sides ni exist ang duha. Okay, puros mga real numbers. But then, ni exist silang duha nga dili equal. So, for this case, the limit of the function does not exist. Okay, so that's it for this example. See you in the next videos.